Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Exotic Astrology. So finally I'm shooting in 4K. Let me know how this video appears. <laughs> Alright, so today we are going to discuss on a topic which we have discussed so many times which is Saturn. Why? 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 Why we are going to discuss Saturn? Because the new year is about to come. New year uh, 2024, right? If you add 2024, it comes to 8. Now what is 8? Eight? 8 in numerology is the number of Saturn and Saturn is also the farthest planet in Vedic astrology. If you ignore Uranus, Neptune and Pluto, of course, so therefore, uh, this year, 2024, should uh, come with the understanding of Saturn, which means, now what is Saturn? Saturn typically represents so many things, right? Saturn represents hard work, delays, disappointment, setbacks. Saturn represents uh, patience, uh, your attitude to be a patient sometimes, right? So therefore... Saturn is a very important planet since it teaches us things which no other planet teaches us. You know, it teaches us things which we don't like to learn but we need to learn them. Okay, So that is why Saturn is very important because he is a planet which uh, wants good for us but uh, not in the best possible way. Which means he teaches us things in a way that we... We would like to run run from all right so we want to run away from all this right so therefore it is very important that we understand saturn in its right context and 2024 again is the year of saturn so if we do not understand saturn then maybe we are not able to use uh, this new year in the best possible way which means we now, how do you know if you are using your Saturn properly? You know, if you are uh, letting, if you are letting Saturn do the job, which means if Saturn is bringing some difficulties, you are not just sitting and rebelling. You are actually sitting and uh, working with Saturn. Then this is very important. Otherwise, if you are just uh, resisting, you are fighting Saturn, you know, then it doesn't work because. Then what happens is uh, you, you don't change, you remain the same, you remain absolutely the same. And because of this, what happens is we lose all the potential for uh, transformation. Okay, So therefore, if you are at a stage in the end of 2023 where you know that life is calling you for something bigger, then don't resist it, my dear friend. Don't protest against it. Don't... Uh, say no to it you know it may be difficult and for sure it will be difficult it's the year of saturn which means it won't be easy now i'm not saying there will be some big disaster or new year i'm not speaking of that uh, now some people have said you know there's new this covid variant has come no i'm not talking of all this you know that is a separate discussion but what i am telling is uh, individual difficulties difficulties of your mind you know pain to control the mind you know so this year you must read the bhagavad gita and learn to control the mind that will actually help you to understand 2024 and uh, you can actually become a much better person after this year ends all right uh, when i say this year i mean uh, 2024 so therefore learn more about saturn i have a ton of videos many dozen videos on saturn uh, there's a playlist on saturn saturn remedies please watch it and then you will understand more and more about saturn all right uh, so wishing you all the best for the new year the year of saturn so don't fear but understand that we have to work hard all right thank you so much wish you all the best and see you again soon namaste